so unbothered by me being here. It's unbelievable. Welcome to the Findhorn Valley in the Monolith Mountains. What a glorious morning it's turned out to be. Um, when I first woke up it was raining heavily but it's now stopped and uh, it's actually looking like it's going to be a cracking day. This is a great part of the Highlands because it feels quite wild. So there's a really good chance of finding something up here in the hills and that's, uh, that's really as much of a plan as I've got today. I've got my camera. I'm going to walk up into these uh, into these hills, sort of above the Findhorn Valley, and I'm just going to spend the day up here and see what I find. And if or when I find something interesting, I'll talk to you again and uh, show you what it is. so close and uh, well now it's moved over the moved over the crest of this next uh, bit of hill and I'm not going to push my luck and try and follow it because if it's just on the other side of there I'll spook it for absolute certain so I'm just going to back off now and uh, go and get my rucksack and uh, 
Oh, that was amazing. That was so good. I wonder if this hair is uh, used to being photographed because he just seemed so unfazed. Disaster, possibly. Uh, drop the uh, the Osmo Pocket. Now I'm recording on it now, and it does seem to work, but uh, it doesn't start up properly every time now. So I don't know whether that's going to be um, something that gets worse or something that fixes itself, or whether it's uh, maybe something that uh, needs to be fixed by DJI. That was so annoying. I was worried then. I thought that was it. Completely buggered. Um, it might still be. We'll see. Anyway, I've not seen any hairs for ages. Um, it seems like that hill where I saw them first this, uh, this morning is where all the hairs are. So I've been walking for another kilometre or so now and I've seen nothing much. seen any hairs until now. Just seen one and uh, see if I can get some pictures. I also think the sun's going to come out from behind the clouds in a moment so fingers crossed if everything comes together you might get a picture or two if it's a nice light. Thank you. 
Whew. Well, that was just fantastic. That's, I don't know how long I spent uh, watching it. Um, certainly long enough that my feet and fingers feel pretty blooming cold now. Um, but yeah, I got some lovely video and I'm sure I got some lovely pictures and it was just so unfazed by my being there. It was just unreal. Just an amazing, amazing experience. And uh, yeah, I've retreated back to where I left my rucksack and uh, I'm pleased to say the hair is still there. I managed to leave again without disturbing it. So yeah, absolutely amazing. Yeah, so I'm going to end today's video here. We've had uh, quite an exciting time with the hares earlier, and then the fornicating frogs, and then this little hare just now, absolutely out of this world. Um, yeah, I'll, uh, I'll finish with some footage of uh, a group of goats I saw earlier and uh, anything else I find on my way between here and the car, I suppose. Um, hope you've enjoyed the video. Um, I've enjoyed making it, as I always do. They're great fun. Um, if you do like what I'm doing with this, uh, please consider subscribing. Thank you very much to those of you that already have. And uh, leave a comment and let me know what I could do better or give me some suggestions for future projects or... Uh, different ways to film things so yeah um, thank you very much for watching and uh, goodbye